So for the people that have to deal with people that throw them away, be careful with their time. Be careful with their energy. Think about the amount of effort that you put into other people. Because if you're not accomplishing things, you're not resolving your own problems, and you're not getting ahead, but you're spending a lot of time and energy and effort to make someone better, and in the, in the end, that they throw you away like you're garbage and that you never mattered, then you have to be okay with helping people out of the kindness of your heart. And if they do treat you that way, don't let it bother you that you have value, that you're a kind person, you're nice, and you'll need to be validated that you care about people and that you're compassionate and you have empathy. Because sometimes some people just don't see it. That they assume that they're a nice person. They assume they're kind. They assume they're sweet. But they really don't see that. They don't see that they're not those things. That they can be, but they're not. And their actions or their inactions matter. So don't toss people away that have always been there for you. Even if it's like an ex-girlfriend, ex-boyfriend, it could be childhood friend. Like, appreciate people. Appreciate people for what they have done for you. If they've done something that really helped you through difficult times and they were there for you and they made a difference in your life, appreciate these people. Because if you think that they're nothing and that you don't value them, then one day you will have regrets and you will have resentment because that person that you treated bad will be the person that could have given you an opportunity. Maybe they'll be a bigger person and give you a chance when you don't deserve it. Or maybe they will be like you and not give you this chance to say, I'm sorry, can't do it. So really value people, respect people, and just really try your best to appreciate people that are always there for you, that care about you. And if we start to think that they have expectations or they have guarantees, and that they're wanting to do something to help us because they are expecting something back and they need something from you, then we're going to get ourselves in daily traps. We're going to be self-sabotaging and that we don't deserve to achieve things if we don't respect people. Because assuming is negative. If we're assuming that we are thinking what we think that person is thinking, that we're assuming something. Oh, I assumed that you were like this. Or I assumed that you were helping me because you were expecting something back. And that I assumed you were this type of person. But when you have the facts, the facts don't lie. When you have exposure, you have connection, you spent time with someone that those facts don't lie. The proof is in the pudding that is there. Is there. But it's not up to us to get even, to punish somebody, or to even re remind someone that they're not treating us good. The time is this to get rid of those people and cut the fat out of your life. Get rid of them like the fat on a steak. Cut it off. Get rid of it. Because if you're not, if you don't have healthy friendships, healthy relationships, then why are you gonna waste time, energy? Why are you gonna get frustrated? Why are you gonna allow it to affect your life? and hold you back if someone does not value you that they don't respect you they don't appreciate you because 
people that don't appreciate other people for the good things that they have done in their lives, those people are not good people. They may assume that they're good people, that they have a lot to work on. They have a lot of weaknesses when they're treating their family bad and they're talking down on their parents and that they are dissolving friendships. 